The, oh, there's the corgi. What are you doing? I'm building my Martin house that I got for my birthday. My mom got me the telescopic pole yesterday, so I'm putting it. Twelve families. <laughs> uh, unlike Lennon, those babies will come back year after year and won't leave me alone. And empty feeling. So. There's Lennon. <gasps> corgi will stop. <laughs> What? Good movie. Saturday. Or no, it's not Saturday. It's Sunday. Feels like Saturday because we didn't go to church. I read directions. I'm like... Watch it knock them in the middle. For the five million thing. <laughs> knock them in the middle is one of the funniest shows ever. Isn't it, Corgi? What do you think? Do you concur? He says, I concur, Mommy. Anything you say. That's daylight savings time. So we had to spring forward this morning. And we slept super, super late. So we're getting a super late start to the day. I'm going to go do dishes. And maybe make a cheesecake. And at some point this afternoon, we're going to go out and put up the Martin box. And put the planters in the and put the planters in the ground dig the holes and kind of get started on that all right see you later corgi bye look at that sploot it is magnificent let's get the back angle because there is no bad side table. Should be in town, huh? looks like it you know me too oh, 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 oh. oh and then he's like what mommy what what, mommy? What is y'all's deal? That one can be kind of mean. She's being pretty nice right now, though. That was a baby not too long ago. Here's a baby. This is a baby cow. That's a big cow. It was a baby. Too. And there's my rooster. Okay, so I want to put my Martin box here in this corner because back behind that tree line there is the ditch. And the ditch um, always has water in it. You're supposed to put it where they have access to water because they swoop down and uh, that's how they drink they go shwoom, and they drink water so that's that's where i want to put it but my my cardinal bird feeder is here now so i gotta take it down and hope that the cows don't get mad at me and try to break through the fence and, and eat me um, so that's what we're doing okay i've got the drill Walking back out here, the cows are yelling at me. I don't speak cow, so I don't know what they're saying. There is Moran and and uh, Solomon. This is my Martin house. I put it together this morning, as y'all saw. Um, my granddad always had uh, he had three big Martin houses and a bunch of gourd houses for the Martins. His colony was hundreds. He had hundreds of purple Martins that lived outside. Um, during the summer and they eat each little Martin eats their weight in mosquitoes every day and Mosquitoes are really bad in Arkansas. So I'm hoping that will help um, If I get a Martin colony going um, According to the little pamphlet that came with it Martins have almost been domesticated the Native Americans used to hang gourd houses for them and I don't know why maybe for the mosquitoes. I don't I don't know maybe they ate them I don't know um, but either way apparently the Martin has become completely dependent on humans for their housing they don't know how to make houses for themselves now so uh, we have to build them houses this is my cardinal feeder it's seen better days it probably needs to be replaced I've had it for a few years now it's, it's done its due diligence so that's that's my pole. 
uh, that my mom bought for me. And we'll put it together. Oh, here comes some more chickens. That is Ruth. And there's Solomon again. And Margaret. So, hello, cow. I was curious what I'm doing. We're just gonna do these two screws here. That scared the snot out of the cows. <laughs> See, she's leery. Oh. And there it goes. Okay. All right. Solomon and Ruth and Margaret and I don't know the cow's names. That's what I was saying earlier. Do you know the cow's names? Uh, uh, the little one with the brown that's Freckles. I named her Sally though. And that's her little sister. They're button heads. And that's their mama with the horns. I don't think she has a name. So pretty cow, aren't you? And there's another baby eating a salt block. And here's some here. That's a bull. The one with the That's little a bull? I think so. Uh, no, I no. It's got a broader head than the other. I think it's a bull. I don't know. Yeah, it's a bull. Do you not see? <laughs> it's a yeah, bull. I'm going so. to explain to Clint. Yeah. What is its name? I don't know. It may not be named. You want to name it? Come here, bye buddy. No, I'll okay. the You can name it. You and out the there's a little, family. out there's a little baby cow. And. <laughs> oh. Birdseed. Nice, smart little chicken. Where are you putting the Martin house? I'm going to put it up against that pole there in the corner. Oh, yeah. And uh, because it's supposed to be near a body of open water, and I figured the ditch, they can drink the water in the ditch, and then it'll give them all yeah. the cow pasture out there as crazy grounds. That's the newest little baby. The little. The little. I love the cows so much. 
they eat out of our hands. Yeah, I tried to feed some cow to them. Cow? <laughs> They're herbivores. <laughs> He's like, oh, kill, no, to use Lemon's joke. Oh, kill, no. Look at those pretty white eyelashes. Oh, that one's peeing. Come here, baby. You're so fluffy. I just want to scruffle your head. Come here. Ah, oh, that's why my phone's vibrating. Sally, the little, she'll let you pet her. She's a sweet girl. out of the cardinal feeder. Let's go get the drill. Here we go. There you are. Come on. Let's go. This is chicken update. This is two weeks later maybe? Almost two weeks later? Three weeks for our little Wyandots and Buff Orpingtons. If you notice though, sadly, None of the little bantams made it. Our little fluffy, cute, tiny bantams. So, that's where we are with that. Pretty soon, I'm surprised these little fellas aren't jumping up on the side trying to hop out. Hey, guys. Nope. Let's see who we can pet. Who wants to You look like you want to be petted. Say, hey. Hey. Oh, they don't need a corgi. They don't need a corgi. <laughs> And here's our ducks. I don't think you can even see them. These red lights, it won't focus, focus, focus. Yeah, the red light makes it really bad. There's the ducks. And the chick chicks. And the daddies. Oh. Corgi wants some food too. Or some chicken. He might want chicken. Or duck. He's like, I'm not picky. I'll take a duck too. I'll take a duck too. <laughs> Okay, so apparently to use that pole with my Martin box, you have to have a round pole adapter that's like $16. So I'm angry now and frustrated and I dug the hole and I can't put up the Martin box today because I've either got to get the adapter thing or get a different pole. So, yeah. So ends our Martin box adventure. What kind of little bird is that? It's really pretty.
pretty. It's white and black. It's not a little woodpecker, is it? Then he flew away. He flew away. What are you doing, Corgi? Doing work. I'm a working dog. Are you working? Are you daddy's little assistant? Oh. What are you doing? Sir, rock walkway that is on the to-do list. It's been on the to-do list since last summer. I can't sell this rock. <sighs> right now, just follow a car around. And he is going to run after off the ball. I thought it was Solomon there for a second. I thought it was Solomon. He found it. He's so excited. Oh. This <laughs> uh, the chickens running after our brush pile we cleaned up. Roosters running after hens. And of course Corgi runs after all of them. You think it's gonna rain today though? I don't Fox, look what I got. This ball, this glow dark ball got left out like last year. What do I have? What do I have? What do I have? He's, he's there. The ball's here. Oh, he just figured it out. Go get it. Go get it. Oh, I think I threw it out. Of, we gotta check his little fence thing. I think it. Yeah, because when he was super little. And when he walked into potty, I'd always bring him to this tree. <laughs> and so, I think, yeah, his range has been turned down. Mommy's so mean. I shouldn't have thrown it like that, should I? What have you got, Corgi? Have you got your squeaky ball? What? What? Oh my gosh, it is freezing. It's, oh, such a big boy. Can I have it? Can I? Oh, 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 this is the game. Oh, my hands are cold because it's cold. Oh. Well, I would throw it. Uh, some kitty cat situation going on up there, isn't it? I don't know. Oh, found that. No! <laughs> I was blowing across the yard because I cleaned out the garage. It's a paycheck of stuff from his from like 20 years ago. But a good like 12 across our yard. I was like, whoops. Whoopsie daisy. <gasps> really good. He won't go out in the road, but we keep it on him because I don't want him to get brave and go out there and something sad happen. Do we? Mommy be a sad mommy. Let's go in. Let's go in where it's warm. You ready to go in, sir? Are you ready to go in, sir? Whew. Mommy needs to paint the front door. That was one of my spring to-do list things I wanted to do, but I'm thinking it may not get done this year. Look at my Christmas lights. <sighs> so cold. Pitiful. 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 Well, I, I got him. Beautiful. Oh, I think that might, I think... Me. Okay, we can wrap up. 
Miranda is making something. Key lime cheesecake. Mm -hmm. So good. I'm gonna like all that. And uh, the ladies have done their part. Mm -hmm. Eggs. All right. So, what do we want to say? Mm -hmm. <laughs> the Martin Paul was a th or the Martin. Who talked about the Martin house being a failure? Yeah, I did. And then I. I'm gonna send them a very angry email. <laughs> then I, like a genius, just while cleaning the oven, crack the you can't the see it, crack the glass in the oven. Yeah, we put it on the clean function, and then which she's... works fine. But then I just sit and think, and I put sprayed some stuff on it to wipe it down, and it, and it broke. Glass, so it's not my proudest moment. Yeah, so we gotta fix that. Oh, this is all the stuff that's our storage. It's stored in the oven. Back when I took the the brooding lamps out of uh -huh. the chicken coop, out of Castle de Cluck, um, I, don't, I, mean, it's been I had this in there to keep them warm, and then I switched them to the brood lights, and this is one of the just regular heat bulbs. Okay, I'm gonna put my pretty little pot in the oven, or the oven, the fridge, which is really cool right now. Gee, gee, gee. Oh. That is hard on mine. Jeech. Mm. Oops. Anyway. <laughs> so, anything else that we need to talk about before? We didn't go to church. We didn't go to church. Today, was, today like, saved me the time and somebody <laughs> turned my church alarm clocks off. Which we'd already kind of thought that we might not go because Clint had two words. Here's Clint. Why do we still have a, a penguin on the refrigerator? That's what Lennon, Lennon made that. Isn't it cute? I'm so over winter though. I know. It's cold again now. The wind is blowing again. There's, our, there's Gatsby in March. That's, I know, right? That's Ryan's vlog after college. And we are so happy to... <gasps> Corgi on fleek. <laughs> It's so Calendar. cute though. You're standing in the lot. They can't see. <gasps> that uh, is, oh look, it's Gatsby and Jack and Tamby. So cute. Don't they look like a little bat to the bone trio? Anyways. Tamby's such a pretty little corgi. Mm -hmm. She's if real pretty. We get another corgi, we should get one like her. Look at this. She, Gigi. We have oh. talked about getting another. I don't know if you can see it or not. She's, she's a mess. <laughs> Anyway, um, we have talked about getting a corgi. We've talked about getting like a tricolor female. I don't know. That's just kind of what I'm leaning toward. You know, you get one corgi and kind of just like what could be better than cuddling with one corgi? Two corgis. <laughs> we're waiting for it to rain. If it starts raining, we're going to burn that brush pile in the back. What mm -hmm. was I doing? Oh, I was building the garden beds and Miranda started a side project where she goes through the thick. I got a chainsaw. Right? Chainsaw. And now we have a bunch of brush to burn. And mm -hmm. uh, Oof, that we, looks like a mess over there. Because it is a mess. Our back porch is in no man's land in the yeah, wintertime. I'm not. I was trying to film the cows with our cute little view, but the back porch is a big mess. We did. I don't know if I can see this. Can they look? see? I'll watch it. <laughs> yes. We did I sell it. If you put your elbows against your business I'm here. Don't touch my business. Then, um. That's like the perfect distance. Yeah, this is not a flattering angle though for me. I have a no makeup. You have no non flattering angle. We did sell our old kitchen this weekend, so my garage is like, what, one third clean now? Yeah, I'd say that's fair. <laughs> my it's corner where my tools is. Is a no man's land. Well. And then we have a few other things that's just stored that we gotta fix. But I can see the daylight of getting to park in the garage again. So. Hey, there's the little. No, that's the part of the earpiece. Ear oh, it's broke. Somebody Fox plugged guy. his somebody plugged his earphones up in corgi chewing distance. That's not what happened. I plugged it up on top of the TV and he pulled it down. No. Clint goes through and Lynn and I have, have the same pair of earphones for literally years. You live soft lives. And Clint is heck on stuff that he owns. Much like Prissy Girl is, my little succulents here. 
She hasn't messed with them in a she's long time. She's did better. She has did better. <laughs> yeah, I've been putting just ice cubes. My little zebra. Oh, that's the wrong one. Here we go. See, look, she's pulled that out, and somebody just set that back in. I guess you're linen. But she pulls out these. I don't know why they these. didn't put it back on it, though. It was like a hinge or something. Well, it would be, make some sense, wouldn't it? But she will pull these out and literally plays with it. Like she slaps around with the socks that's laying all over her house that she gets out of stuff. My little zebra for land is from last year. I like that one. Yeah, but it's the only one that's made it. This one and this one's new. I got those, I think, on Valentine's at Home Depot. So, But I think I might need to go get a spoon real quick and plant that just a little better and get some water because it does yeah spoon okay anything yeah, else uh, not that i can think of that's been that's been pretty much it we're looking for a new series to watch on like netflix or hulu it's family yeah. friendly we've been watching episodes of malcolm in the middle which is an awesome show it's hilarious <laughs> but we have watched it over and over and over and over and over again and it puts me to sleep now so um I like Golden Girls and Andy Griffith. Again, though, we've seen every episode a billion times. Why well, mess with something? There's nothing new in the world. There's not. I we've watched all of The Middle, which is, and we've watched most of probably Modern Family. Like, I don't know what else to watch. Not either. If anybody knows of anything, <laughs> probably not because nobody's watching. Well, I mean, there are people watching. All five of you people who watch. Hey, that's five people who I didn't ever to ever ever choose to advertise to on Facebook. So thank that's you, true. thank you for uh, for following us. And um, okay, I'm gonna go lick the bowl. I'm gonna play video games. Let's we'll play video games. And I guess that's our weekend. I don't know if this is recording right now or not. So, mm. anyways, mm. bye.